What is up, guys? I am the Skulls347. This is another episode of Dragon Ball Z Tetra. Thank you to all the new subscribers that subscribed last time. Welcome. This is an epic series. Hopefully you are sticking to them that you've watched ever since the first episode. Let's get right into this episode of Dragon Ball Z Kakura, episode 17. Alright, so we were on the hunt for the androids. So, what is up guys? A hundred subscribers coming up soon. Only seven more people out of the 7.5 billion people on this planet. Wow, can at least a few of you smash a like right now. Smash subscribe. Go ahead and share this to your friends. Seriously, I'm the Skulls 347 and I will be actually premiering something once I hit 100 subscribers. Now, like usual, for a guy who's always exhausted, huh, I am so glad, and I mean so glad, to be getting back into Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. So last time we were kind of just fooling around, getting our buffs that up. Everything, and I mean everything, was still unorganized. And we had to organize it, and we had to level up, and we had to get a few moves, and, you know, and this and that. And, um, Might cause some trouble later. that Best we to deal with really... Oh shit. I just hate when stuff like that just happens. Oh, come on. Really? Uh, okay then. Come on. Dual team tag attack? That's not fair. I may be a little bit sloppy because I was like helping a friend on a different game similar to Dragon Ball. And when things like this happen, kinda is a little bit annoying. But those guys, what? There was a rock here, wasn't there? There was a rock right here. Oh my god. What, it, what the hell is my character doing? I want to talk to Piccolo. You're late. I'm late. What have you been Not doing? Not to see what happened, Piccolo. My mind. Sorry, ran into a few hitches, but I did manage to get in a bit of training, though. I got to fight against Tien. <laughs> I figured as much. Luckily for us, we took the liberty of starting without you. <laughs> Sorry about that. How's the training coming along, Goku? We should be good to go. Yes. We've done so much to prepare. Guess we're about to find out whether our training is sufficient enough to handle these androids. Well, let's see. By the way, guys, absolutely new server. Hopefully you guys come and join the server. Oh my. And at this exact moment... I'm getting texts from my fans. Ah, oh, fans, am I right? Three years had passed, and the fated day of May 12th well, that had was quick. finally come. All right, you three be careful out there. You sure you don't want to take some lunch? No, we're good, Mom. Sorry, Chi Chi. All right, we're off. Uh oh. Uh, 
No, it's probably nothing. Heart attack. <laughs> Oh, wow. Oh wow. Hey Goku, tell me the truth. These androids, do you think we have a chance against these guys? I honestly can't tell you if we do. I won't know until well, we well, actually well. fight them. That's Goku being Goku. Only smart when he's fighting. <laughs> Use up all that power of yours before the fight even starts. Oh, sorry. Oh. Yeah. Whoa. What a amazing power. Hey, look at the squad. Hey, look at the squad. <laughs> Me and the boys just heading out to another city. Five and a half miles southwest of South City. And so, the warriors gathered at the time and place that Trunks had mentioned. Bulma, who was eager to see the androids for herself, greeted them. But she wasn't alone. She had a baby boy in tow. That boy was a young Trunks. The child she had with Vegeta, all except Goku, were surprised to see the child. However, the impending arrival of the androids quickly put everyone back hmm. on edge. Then, as Goku and the others stood ready, flames suddenly began to break out oh in the city. Whoa. Huh? Uh, what? What's going on? An explosion in the city! Is it the androids? Could be. But there's no way to tell from here. Hey, what gives? I couldn't sense their power at all. Th that's it! They're androids. Which means we can't sense their energy. Y you're kidding, right? Where could they be? If we can't sniff them out, then we're just gonna have to <laughs> hunt them right down. Below. All right, guys, split up. If you spot them, let the rest of us know. Got it? Gohan, you go help the people who were caught up in that explosion, okay? Okay. Dun, 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 dun. The, the androids attack. attack. Let's go. There's gonna be so much distortion in this video. Jeez, where could those things possibly be? I'm starting to think I should have had Trunks show me a picture of them or something. I never imagined we wouldn't be able to Why can't I know how to play the game? Talk about a pain. Tian Shenhan! Sorry, but I haven't found the androids. Same here. There's got to be some place we haven't to look. Sorry, guys, because I don't know how to play. If it's me you're after, then show your faces already! I don't know how to, how to play. Krillin, how are things Episodes going with you? Kind of slow. Not so good, Goku. No androids over here. Gotcha. If you find one of them, let us know, okay? What? A lag? Maybe one of the other guys found them. Anything, Piccolo? Nothing at all. There's no trace of them anywhere. All right, be on your guard. Whoa, I just felt a huge drop in someone's energy. It's Yamcha. Oh, Yamcha just got Yamcha again. 
Ninja! Still alive! Whoa. I left some sensu beans behind. Get him out of here and give him one, will ya? Uh, right, I'm on it. So, you're the androids. Odd. How did you figure out that we were androids? And it would seem you also knew that we'd be right here. Why is that? You want us to talk? Then you're gonna have to try and make us. Very well. Wait, not here. Let's move somewhere else. Somewhere with no people. You're okay with that, right? Somewhere with no people? Fine. We will allow you to choose the place of your death, Goku. How do you know Goku's name? We know all of you. You are Piccolo. And you are Tien, yes? We can talk about this later. Let's go! Okay. Let's go to the Gizzard Lands. And of course, I don't know how to use my own controller. <laughs> All right, yeah, let's go, guys. Surprised the androids know about Goku. He's the one who took down the Red Ribbon Army, after all. But they know about all of us as well. That's far enough, Goku. This ends now. We will fight right here. You have lost your right to choose the location. So, before we fight, Tell us, how? Tell us how do you know who we are? Very well, I will tell you. Goku, I have been observing you for quite some time now, using an ultra-small spy robot of mine. During the World Tournament, during your fights with Piccolo and Vegeta, I continued my research long after you destroyed the Red Ribbon Army so that I could someday witness your defeat. Revenge against me, huh? Yes. Because of you, the Red Ribbon Army could never realize its dream of world domination. Only Dr. Giro remained. You're talking almost as if you're Dr. Giro himself. Don't be ridiculous. I am a creation of his. I am Android 20. Dr. Giro is no longer among the living. All right, then. Did you happen to observe my fight on Planet Namek? Huh? There was no need to waste the time. We were able to effortlessly ascertain your power after your fight with Vegeta. You're in for some real trouble, because guess what? You missed the best part! What? Whether you know it or not, you just dug your own grave. You don't know about Super Saiyans. Ah! Oh! I see. Impressive, but no cause for concern. Android 19 here should be more than enough to defeat you. Oh, yeah? Oh. Well, then, what do you say? Let's see what he's got, huh? Okay. Go! Yeah! 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 
Ah, what is this? There we go. You might not be able to move. Maybe not as a big as one of them. Yeah, we get that. Ah, really? At least one good hit. It's all life. Damn, Cook is dying in the midst of battle. This is bad. Oh, yeah. That's right. Why would Goku be trying to rush the fight? He's already nearing his full power. He's in a lot of pain by the looks of him. He absorbed the attack? Goku! Don't Whoa. fire any energy attacks! They can absorb them with their hand! <sighs> absorb the attacks? <clears throat> Give me a break. <sighs> what what's going on? Goku doesn't look so good. Wait. It can't be. It's the heart virus the kid from the future mentioned. What? You mean he hasn't taken the medicine yet? I don't believe it. He seemed perfectly fine when he was training alongside me and Gohan. Damn. Of all the times for Goku to get sick, why did it have to be now? Man, I'm, I'm not doing so hot. What's going on? If one's going to defeat Kakarot, it's going to be me. Not some junk puppets like you! What? What? What's this? Vegeta! I felt an incredible What's energy this? over there earlier. Vegeta. But it's pretty weak now. Maybe the fight's over. Go on! Krillin! Yamcha! What's going on? One of the androids did me in, but Krillin here saved me with the Sensu Bean. I've got more Sensu Beans here. We need to meet up with the others and fast. Over there! Dad? Goku! Boy, oh boy. The hard fire is that the kid from the future mentioned. That's likely what he's struggling with. Somebody needs to get him out of here. Give him that heart medicine right away. I'll take him. I hate to admit it, but I'm probably not going to be much help here anymore. Looks like you've got to deal with me now. Android 20, please on me to exterminate Vegeta. Hmm. Very well. Then I will take care of the remaining four. <laughs> you two don't look as... We already know the full extent of your fighting prowess. 
Oh, you need more than calculations to understand us Saiyans. So tell me, are androids capable of experiencing fear? Vegeta's a... a well, super bitch. Saiyan? I've yearned for nothing more than greater power and trained the hardest I've ever trained. Eventually, I came to realize the limitations of my power. Overwhelmed with anger and frustration, I finally awakened and became a Super Saiyan! That might be oppressive to some. A paltry power increase does not make you a match for us androids. That cocky sneer will soon be turned into sheer terror. Yeah, can we get a replay on that with some epic music? Damn, Vegeta. I never expected you to actually know how to turn into a freaking Super Saiyan. Sorry to bust the goddamn party, but I need to add something to the Vegeta real quick while we're still here. As I thought. It doesn't even have a big bang attack. Give me a break. Good old big bang attack. You tell me that we don't have big bang attack. Whoa, that's that's ludicrous. Hello. That's all that we can actually get right now. Now that I've become a Super Saiyan, no one can best me. Well, let's do this! Yeah! 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 Yeah!
you make a miscalculation some way? Face! I've used up a lot of my power. If you want to take me down, now's your chance. Come at me. Your power may have exceeded my initial calculations, but it's still not enough to defeat us androids. <laughs> You're not going anywhere! I'm going too. I want to see the end of the androids with my own eyes. Yeah, count me in too. Me too. Fine. But don't get pulled into the fight. He's more than you guys can handle. He's trying to lose us among the rocks. If you find him, let everyone else know, okay? Amplify Android Terror. Been no word from Gohan and the others. Unfortunately, I'd better go ask them. Just able to catch him. Instead, since we can't sense his energy, this will be tricky. Etienne, no, I still haven't caught sight of him. As 
No sign of him having left this rocky area. He's more than likely hiding somewhere. Whoa! This power is amazing! Gohan, you find him? No, he's not here. I'm sorry, Mr. Piccolo. Hmm. Well now, this could be fun. I'm ready whenever you are. Let's do this. Special beam cannon! I can't move! Have you seen him, Krillin? Nope. He's pretty well hidden in these rocks. Well, I'll do a little bit of... Damn. I hate to say it, but we might have lost him. Let's go check the other one. This time, I'm trying not to get into any fights. <laughs> no calling your comrades now. Your energy will be all mine. Go on. Android, get over here. Uh, uh, Mr. Piccolo! Over there! <laughs> You're as good as dead. How did they find me? Thanks, Gohan. Krillin, give Piccolo a senzu bean! Uh, okay. That's quite a logic hole right there. And what does a weakling like you hope to accomplish? I will be taking your energy. I 
will eliminate Special Rim Cannon! Special Rim Cannon! Taking your energy now. I will eliminate Damn it! I will eliminate Just as I calculate. Don't take this lightly. Damn it! I will eliminate Special Rim Cannon! I will eliminate you. I will eliminate Special Beam Cannon. This can't be Piccolo's power. Special Beam Cannon! I will eliminate! Special Beam Cannon! Oh, damn it! I can't move! I will eliminate!
Special Grim Colonel! No! I will not be done in by the likes of Piccolo! What does a weakling like you hope to accomplish? <laughs> <laughs> the androids I know. What's going on? You sure about this? If it's not them, who is everyone fighting? Wanna try me with one of your... Uh, I refuse to believe that even Piccolo could have increased his power this much. You're not getting... I have made a grave miscalculation. I have no choice but to return to my lab. I'm ending this my way. Everybody's here, so it looks like we all avoided getting wiped out. Which must mean so we've changed the future. Hmm? Hey, guys! Now! Wow. None of you have any hope of winning! That's kind of an asshole. Guy. Android 17 and 18 will make short work of the lot of you! What? Ah! Mother! Ah! Oh, thank you. Trunks? Trunks? Did he just say Trunks? That's my son's name. Wait, he's from the future. That means... Are you all right? Hey, it's you from before. So you came back, huh? Yeah. I thought I would come and offer my support. But who are you fighting? So, where is that wrinkly robot? He used the smoke to make his getaway. Damn it!
Why didn't you try and save your wife and child just now? Foolishness. I have no interest in things like that. <laughs> I saw what looked like a badly damaged android on my way here. It looks like the androids you fought are different from the ones I've been fighting in my time. Then what the hell are we fighting? Uh, that's not that big of a deal, right? I mean, so history's a little different now. Wait, that creepy geezer was an android? Huh? Yeah. That might have been the actual Dr. Jero. I've seen a photo of him in one of my books. He probably modified himself to extend his life. No way. You mean my coming here years ago changed history this much? He mentioned androids 17 and 18. Those were the two you were talking about, right? Tell us, what do they look like? Right. Android 17 is a young man with long black hair and a scarf around his neck. Android 18 is a young woman, and her outfit is more or less similar to mine. Uh, a female type? Oh, come on. Bulma, do you know where Dr. Zero's laboratory is? He's probably there right now. If I had to guess, it's likely in the mountains up north. I heard that he built it in a cave around there to do his experiments. To think he was a lackey for the Red Ribbon Army. That's crazy. That settles the matter then. We'll find the location of Dr. Giro's lab and destroy it well before he's able to activate androids 17 and 18. <laughs> I'm above such cowardly tactics. Let him activate them. I'll turn them into scrap with my bare hands. No, we have to destroy his lab before he activates the other androids. And if we can't, then we have to avoid fighting until Goku is fully recovered. We have no need for Kakarot. You're forgetting that I'm a Super Saiyan now, too. And I'm no ordinary Saiyan. I'm the prince, which means I'm leagues above Kakarot in terms of power. Don't stand in my way. Vegeta may actually have what it takes to get rid of the androids. As a Super Saiyan, it might just work. I can transform into a Super Saiyan, too. Yet, I was no match for them. I'm going, too. He's difficult to deal with, but I'm not about to watch my father die again. Uh, father? Uh, did he say father? What did he mean? Guess there's no point in keeping it a secret. Not anymore. Kid's name is Trunks. Vegeta is his father. You're his mother. In other words, he's your son. Trunks is the grown-up version of the baby you're holding in your arms right now. What? Uh, really? Uh, well, that explains it. That's why he was able to go Super Saiyan. I think it's probably best we destroy the androids before they've been activated. You guys come with me. We're going to look for Tijero's lab. Right. Yeah. Okay, Bulma. This is important. Could you let my dad know what's going on? And tell him to come help when he feels better? Well, I would, but how am I supposed to do that? Have you seen my plane? Gohan, head back and take her with you. Understand? We're more and than strong I'm enough to destroy the androids. 347 and I am okay. signing Be off. Be careful!